हेलो गाइज वेलकम टू माई चैनल प्रेस द सब्सक्राइब बटन लाइक दिस एंड देन यू हैव टू टैप द बेल आइकन एट दिस टू द सब्सक्राइब बटन लाइक दिस एंड देन यू विल गेट द नोटिफिकेशन फ्रॉम माई चैनल हेलो गाइज एंड वेलकम टू माई चैनल इन दिस वीडियो आई बी एक्सप्लेनिंग यू द डेजिग्नेशन ऑफ अ ग्राइंडिंग व्हील नॉट टिपिकल डेजिग्नेशन ऑफ अ ग्राइंडिंग व्हील इट कंजिस्ट ऑफ दीज सेवन टर्म्स the first number and the last number this is manufacturers symbol because there are various companies worldwide which produce these grinding wheels so these numbers first and the last they are uh, they give the information about who the manufacturer of this grinding wheel is for different manufacturers these numbers can be different all right now the second term it denotes the abrasive now abrasive it can be carbide aluminum oxide diamond artificial uh, silicon carbide etc so it denotes the abrasive here it is c c means carbide if it had been a it would have denoted aluminum oxide al2o3 Al two O three aluminium oxide, or it can be diamond. So it would have been written D for diamond, <coughs> and uh, it can be uh, artificial silicon carbide. So S can be written. So second term denotes the abrasive. Now third term it denotes. this term it denotes the grain size now grain size means that on the grinding wheel the size of the grain whether it is small whether it is medium whether it is large now grain size now here it is written 30 now 30 comes under medium category so grain size it is in three categories if it is 10 to 24 that means if this number here it is written 10 to 24 so it is roughening that means the grain size is very big that means this grain size is very big if it is written 30 to 60 then it is medium grain size medium if it is written 70 to 80 180 then that means it is a smaller grain size it is used for finishing operation finishing operation if it is 220 to 600 that means it is super finishing operation very fine particles it is used for super finishing so now what this number it represent it represent the number of particles or openings per inch square number of openings number of openings upon per inch square that means if we take 1 inch by 1 inch square of a grinding wheel then what are the number of particles present here if the number of particles are more that means number of particles will be smaller because to accommodate in this much area if no more number of particles are there that means the particle is smaller if less number of particles are there that means the particles are larger in size so if the number is less that means 10 to 24 particles are only there so that means they are bigger particles and as we increase the number that means 220 to 600 particles are there that means they are very fine or very small particles so this number represents this number of particles or the grain size now next comes m m means hardness it denotes the hardness for a up to h it is denoted as soft grinding wheel from i to 
P. It is medium. Medium. Grinding wheel. From Q to Z, it is hard grinding wheel. Now, M, it lies between this, so it is medium grinding wheel. Had it been some, uh, suppose D, so it had been soft because it lies between A to H and it, had it been U or something, so it, it would be lie between Q and Z, so it would be hard. So this number denotes the hardness. Hardness. It denotes the hardness. Next number comes, it comes the structure. This number denotes the structure. Now, structure, if the value is between 0 to 7, it is closed structure. It, if it is between 8 to 16, then it is open structure. So, this value 6 comes between 0 to 7, so it is closed structure. This denotes the structure. Zero to seven, so it is closed structure. Eight to sixteen, it is open structure. And last comes with uh, this V. V it denotes the type of bond between the abrasive particles and the grinding wheel. Type of bond. It can be vitrified, so it would have been written V. Here it is written V, so it is vitrified. With V I T R I. S I E D with refined bond. Other can be silicate bond. Or it can be rubber bond. Capital R for rubber bond. Or it can be M for metal bond. So, in totality, in summary, let me summarize these two terms. They are denoting the manufacturer which has produced this grinding wheel. This term, it denotes the type of abrasive particle. This term, it denotes the grain size, whether it is uh, number of grains per unit per square inch. And this M, it denotes the hardness, whether it is soft, medium or hard. This term, it denotes the structure, whether it is closed structure or open structure. And finally, this term denotes the type of the bond. So, I hope you have found the video helpful. And if you found the video helpful, please share this video, please like the video. And please subscribe my channel if you have already not subscribed. And please check the description once for more of my social media links and other video links. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.